education. One of our to our over the next three years to fix issues with the labor pay system and upgrade ACA infrastructure compared to the amount to establish child schools. I'm going to walk with Vicky Kay. Mr. Speaker, what a great question on behalf of the Minister of Education. The member has actually asked three questions in that primary, but I will be very generous today and answer all of them. <laughs> with regards to MCA, we are committed to having 85% of 18 year olds achieving MCA level 2 or an equivalent qualification in 2017. The Ministry of Education and NZQA work together to ensure that MCA is a credible, learner centred qualification for the over 165,000 school learners that seek to achieve MCA every year. In budget 2013, uh, $215 million has been allocated to specific uh, initiatives which support student achievement. We've also set aside $19 million as a small pool of pool funding to help set up partnership schools. That's a very small amount in the scheme of things of a $9.7 billion education budget. Regarding the school payrolls, my colleague, Minister Joyce, has responsibility for that area. I advise that progress continues to be made on catching up the backlog and ensuring that payroll instructions are processed in the period in which they are received. And finally, the Minister is reserving his position on the long-term future of NOVA pay and an amount of $8 million in contingency funding has been set aside should 